if you look at overall the event and his performance throughout the whole event, he performed the best for his team and he's the one who was leading the way for them into these finals. You know, obviously, you know, they met FaZe and FaZe is it was better today. Let's say it, let's be honest about it. And you know, and I mean, he's still he's team. still young, he's still inexperienced, right? I I think he's definitely going to say that he didn't perform individually up to the level that he would have liked to. But it's also different when you play a team like FaZe in a grand final, right? And I'm sure you know, with more tournaments, more scenarios like this one, he's going to get there. Yeah, there's a there's a bit of a learning under chaos, learning under pressure, which is exactly what Int subjected themselves to uh, within making it this far in Pro League, much less a grand final for a guy like Spinks. Uh, I think the future is everything. We see him getting mic'd up now. We're going to be talking to him just shortly. Uh, and in the meantime, for the rest of Int, uh, any bright spots you want to talk about? Madden. Definitely. I mean, of ever since he was brought in, he brought their game to the very next level. We spoke about how he's a vocal player, how he's a versatile player. He's going to be that secondary voice in the team. He's going to deliver the numbers. And he, he did just that on the maps like Mirage, on the maps like Nuke as well. And in the grand finals, he had a, he had a massive impact. You know, it wasn't enough at the end, but he showed that he can play on a high level for his team. Yeah, and also in that the big moments don't really affect him, right? Like he's still just sticking to his own game and, and helping his team win. Yeah, and that's what Spinks hoped to do today. It didn't quite go that way, but for us, we're going to catch up with the DHL MVP. Spinks, can you hear me? Are you there? Hello, guys. Can you hear me? Yes, I absolutely can. Hello? Commiserations. Nice. Uh, nice. Hey, uh, commiserations. Tough day in the office for you, bud. Yeah, it wasn't really my day. I couldn't get uh, things going, but... Uh, it is what it is. You can't be 100% every day. Yeah, I mean, congratulations on a great run. Uh, in the end, wasn't your day today? You know, we were. I, I think everyone was pretty surprised after the the veto, seeing that phase vetoed out Nuke left Vertigo. And how was it for you guys? You know, did you get a little bit shocked by it, or was it just more like, all right, Vertigo, it is. Let's just get to it. Uh, we talked about it. There is a small chance they will risk it, but we didn't really thought they were going to do it. And they did, and uh, yeah, they catch us uh, off guard. Uh, congratulations on the run, like Yanko said, and obviously commiseration on losing the final there. I want to ask you about the, the progress of the team since Madden joined. Can you speak about like the atmosphere in the team? Obviously now the emotions are high after the finals, but overall in a team and atmosphere, what, what, what's, like, what's it like? The atmosphere in the team is great. I think Madden is... Great guy, great player. He put a lot of positive vibes in the team. Also, think Ades made a huge improvement. And uh, yeah, we're just having fun, working hard, and uh, moving forward. Yeah, obviously, it was a, a tough game here in the final for you, but the RMR is uh, coming up as well. Like, Do you feel this run, and especially the grand final, will help you guys coming into some big games in the future? Could you feel that in this game there was a little bit of nerves kind of preventing you from playing your A game? Uh, I don't think I, I don't think I didn't play my A game because of nerves. I wasn't nervous. Maybe in the start of Vertigo, but nothing special. But I just think it really wasn't my day. They were hitting good shots on me, and uh, yeah, I think for the RMR, it might be hard for us because now we're like top two on ESL Pro League, so we are not coming as underdogs anymore. Now we are coming like as favorites, and I'm afraid it might like go back to us. But yeah, just a normal tournament, practice normal, and uh, we'll do our best. Hey, uh, look, last thing before we get you out of here, uh, check it out. There's Ents fans, there's Sphinx fans, and then there are just people that you might want to send a message to. Is there anything you want to say before we let you go? Well, thanks, everyone, for the support. And, uh, yeah, pleasure to read all your messages and everything. And uh, until next time. Yeah, I like that. Very short and sweet to the point. Thank you so much, Sphinx. We'll see you later.